Good morning, everyone. I hope that you're having a great morning so far. So last week we started talking about what love looks like. And some of the things that we said, we said love was patient. And we said love was kind. We said love was um, not boastful and not pride. And that um, we admitted when we made mistakes. And that was part of being loving. So this week, we're going to say that in addition to those things, that love is respectful, that we show the other person that they matter, and that when we've made a mistake, we can tell them, hey, I've made a mistake, I'm sorry. Um, love is selfless. Selfless is a little bit of a harder word. It means that we're concerned about other people and how their feelings are. So selfless is a good thing to practice in your homes or in your school when you really want to think about what the other person is thinking or doing. Love is calm. We know what that calm is. And love is righteous. Righteous is a little bit another word. Right just means that you're always trying to do what the right thing is. And that's really hard sometimes. You know, you may not want to do it and... You may not feel like doing it, and you may not want to do it for that person. But righteous means that you're still going to try to do it. And you're still going to do it with all those other things that we said. You're still going to try to do it being respectful and calm and patient. And so, again, from the book of Corinthians, just like we learned last week, it says in 1 Corinthians, it does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. That's kind of where that calm comes in. And it does not keep a record of wrongs. So when we've done something wrong or somebody's done something wrong to us, we don't say, you know what, you did this and you did that and I'm not going to forgive you. We still love them no matter what. Um, and so some of these things are really, really hard to do, especially when people could, you could be angry with somebody or somebody did some things that are, are mean to you. We still have to try to be able to love them. And so some of the ways that we know that we're loving them is we're patient and we're kind and we're calm and we treat them the way that we would want to be treated. So last week I told you to get out the coloring page that um, Heidi had put in the trumpet for this month. And in the middle I put love is, and then the things that we learned last week I put in patient, kind, not envious, and humble. And then this week I will put in the words respectful, selfless, calm, and righteous. And I'll color that in. So, um... Enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you tonight for our story. Peace, everyone.